All right, so this SAT math problem says the first term in the sequence is nine. Each term after the first is four times the preceding term. If W represents the nth term of the sequence, which equation gives W in terms of N? All right, so first off, let's just cross out two answer choices. It cannot be A or B because they have the value four represented as the starting term, and then they have it reversed with the nine being uh, raised to a power right so because we know that the first term is nine that is the starting value right we know that every term after that is four times the preceding term and therefore the scale factor of four is being applied onto each consecutive value therefore we can't have that consecutive application of the four times the preceding term if it is outside the parentheses being squared by n right so it cannot be a and it cannot be b so is it either C or is it D? Well, this is key information. It says if W represents the nth term, so W represents the nth term, and we know the first term right now is nine, right? So if we know the first term is nine, that means if we plug in one for N, we should get a value of nine, right? So for this first problem right here, we have nine times four to the power of N, so that's just nine times four, we get 36, 36, is not equal nine. But for D, we get nine times four, oops, nine times four, N, which you know is one because it represents the first term. So one minus one is zero. Anything to the power of zero will give us a value of one. So nine times one is nine and nine is nine. Therefore, our answer choice here is going to be D. So yeah, that does it for the video, guys. Make sure you check out our other SAT prep videos, and I'll see you in the next one.